Okay, and here we go. We're on to the second video here. Now we're going to continue with our fight that we haven't started yet. With our janitors. The ultimate warrior where he... This, he would have a lot more tassels, to be honest. But that's okay. We, we just got to make Bill. We got Jack Bauer. Except I don't think he would go with the rifles. I'm going to go... I'm gonna give him like. I'm gonna give him pistol. That's good. I'm gonna give him a, a, like a backup pistol. He's a pretty smart guy, so you always have a pistol with him. Uh, Danny DeVito. Danny DeVito face. Yeah, this is looking pretty good. I'm. I think I'm. I'm ready to go. All the people. All right, folks. Here we go. Action packed. Got our tank to lead the way. And we already see our first alien. We're gonna focus on him. Well, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna first get the tank out of the way of everybody. You know. You don't wanna just like have him go in the way. Why is he not going? Brrr. Perfect. Oh, and another alien. I'll tell you what. Get ready to get your face blown up, alien. Oh. I'll try to stay away from the ship. Okay, I didn't really stay away from the ship, but I did kill that guy pretty handily. Because of the awesomeness of rocket tank. We'll be facing that way. That's very good. Okay, next guy. The ultimate warrior. Show him what you got, Ultimate Warrior. Now you can kind of choose by the looks of it here. You can have an aim shot or, or a snap shot. I want to go with this. This auto shot? That's probably pretty good. Oh yeah, you really are the Ultimate Warrior. Oh, it's uh... Well, uh, people might be wondering what's going on here. So this like takes it, changes the elevation. This here gives you like a little map. Uh, you know, this kind of like take a look at the guy or whatever and what's what's on him. Uh, this centers him on the screen. This goes to the next guy, and this goes to the next guy and cancels ends this guy's turn. You know, so. I would like to remind everybody that I've never actually played this game before. I'm just like really good at picking up video games. Like this is cl they make this game so easy to understand. I don't know why people say, "Oh, look at all these buttons. How are you supposed to figure this all out?" Uh, it's pretty straightforward. Like look at it. What else? Of course that means go as far as you can uh and make sure you stop to have a snapshot. Clearly. What else could that possibly mean, you know? Wanna send out man without a face over here too. Wanna get John McClain into the action, because of course you gotta have John McClain. And I'm gonna I'm gonna get him look that way. Okay, and Liam Neeson. Now I don't think I'm gonna bother with bringing the other guys out because I mean we got a lot of guys out there, so these guys will just stick around and like they'll play sorry or whatever. You know, they'll they'll just be chilling out there. Okay. They're looking pretty good. We're just gonna chill out here. We're gonna hit this button, which clearly indicates end of turn. Ooh, hidden movement. What's gonna happen? Well, apparently nothing. Well that's fine. I'm gonna click on that so he doesn't go too far. Okay. You see what happens? You have so many time units. And he's used up a bunch of his, but he's saved enough so he can take a shot. That's what the green means. Time units, clearly. Green is universally known as time units. Uh, the 81, that's the energy, probably. Like, so if he's out of shape, you know, they won't go as far. The, the red, that's the, the health, you know, before he dies. 
and the purple is morale. Because purple is also always known as morale. Clear. See? Super easy. I don't know why people are always saying like, oh, XCOM is one of the most difficult games that you can play. This is like easy. Easy to understand. Pick up. I would rank it in top three of just pick up and go kind of games. Right up there with like Pong. Right? Uh, we're going to send out Jack Bauer with his pistol. Way of C, Jack. Uh, nothing. All right. Well, these guys, they're just breaking out the, the sorry board right now. They're, that's pretty good. Okay. I want to actually also send these guys over to go look at the ship. We're going to bust in there like... Yeah, yeah this has got to be the ship I shot down. Because what else is it going to be? It's not like they, they just like opened an Apple store in the middle of the woods. You know, that's that's not Apple style. Because clearly that's what... It looks like Apple designed this. Look at that. Okay. Now. Send out the ultimate warrior. And that's our turn. Still, still not a... Like, aside from just shooting those two aliens in the face, like a professional, uh, still not a lot going on. Like, they haven't... Maybe they're just dazed from, from our grand attack, you know? They just didn't see it coming. We're like, we're like ninjas. Like ninja janitors. Ready to save the world. Okay, I'll save that for later. Send out my tank to go make sure there's nobody wandering around in the mountains here. Okay. Ultimate Warrior, you're going to climb the mountain. No, it doesn't seem right that you, we just have the Ultimate Warrior, but we don't have his, like, theme song playing in the background. You know, like, that. I think that would make him, like, a lot more ready to, you know, handle aliens if, if he had this music. Well, um, maybe I should look into that. Okay, what do we got? Oh, wait! Danny DeVito, get back in place. Oh, no. Well, you're just going to have to walk back. That's I'm just going to do that for you. He got distracted, you know. All right. And this turn. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, you, you better buckle up because it's now time to bust in here. Who's going to be our person to send in there first? Well, clearly it's going to be Liam Neeson. That guy's afraid of nothing. Ooh. Look at this. These guys are just... Have no idea! Ooh. Get another shot in these guys. And that's why you don't mess with Liam Neeson. Not the character from his movies, but like Liam Neeson himself, you know. Man without a face. You go check it out there too. Oh, there was another alien hiding. Well, don't worry. Man without a face will take care of you. Oh, man. Perfect. Well, I just like killed like five aliens. And there's five seats. I can't imagine there would be too many more people. If there was more people, that just means they just made a guy just stand, you know? That's just not cool. But of course, these are evil aliens trying to take over the world, so maybe they would just make a guy... St no, you just stand there for this whole space journey we're about to take, you know? Okay, what's next? Okay. Anything else? Oh, he's just motoring. He doesn't even care. He doesn't care that he, he might just be walking into a trap. Okay, Ultimate Warrior is still fine. Okay. Well. 
Maybe I, I overkilled it with all of these great action heroes, you know? Whoa! Well, I beat the... Well, I defeated all those aliens pretty handily. See? This is a super easy game. I don't know why people are always complaining all the time. Look at this. Like, I did okay. Okay? I did pretty awesome. I don't know what you're saying, writings. Well, I looks like I got some power sources and a US UFO navigation. Well, I think we did pretty good. The ultimate war. Ooh, promotions. Man without a face. Liam Neeson. Oh, yeah, this is who he I'm pretty proud of our boys. That's pretty good. You know. Um. Well. Let's go take a look at it and see if we can sell some stuff. You know. Is there anything else? I'm getting rid of this other heavy cannon. See, we don't even need it. You know. We're so good. We don't clearly need this stuff. Ooh. Look at all this. I'll tell you what, I'm going to sell some of this stuff, because look at all the sweet cash I can get. You know, I'll, I'll save some of it for later. Actually, you know, I'll just go... I'm going to do away with these completely for now. Who would want to buy a corpse? Well, if someone's willing to pay it, why not? Alright, I'm going to keep those other things. Alien alloys. Ooh. Alrighty then, we got up to a million dollars. Like, look, they... I'm feeling pretty good about us saving the world here, ladies and gentlemen. What's next there? Oh, I don't know. View research. Oh, we got a laser pistol now. Oh, very nice. Allocate the research. We're gonna... Well, we could get a, plas a plasma rifle, but we just have one. It would just be like, not good. I say, let's get some laser rifle going. Because lasers are always awesome. You know, you can do so many things with lasers. You can, like, make your cat go crazy. Try and catch it. Which is entertaining. You can use lasers to, like heat up your pizza pops or whatever. Ooh, I'm gonna allocate the manufacturer. Here we go. Let's start getting some, some ninjas building us some laser pistols. We're gonna get, uh, we'll, we'll start off with a few, you know, we got, okay, here we go. Ooh, it looks like the target is complete. That's pretty good. Well, well, let's see if I can build. Is there anything else I want to build? Well, not at this time. And probably in a little bit. You know. I didn't know it. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to build another living quarters. And I'm going to actually go ahead and build another workshop. When I get more money. Well, still living quarters are good. You know. You want people to space out, you know, have the ability to kick up their feet, you know. Small, very low. Ooh. Let's get our interceptor to intercept. Put that name to good use, you know. Go after him. Shoot him down. You know, it's not very exciting when it's just like a couple of blips on the screen. Ooh. Aggressive attack. It's not very exciting, it's just like a blip on the screen. Well, they're very good. I'll go catch him. Don't let him... Okay, here we go. We have another fight on our hands, ladies and gentlemen. This is very good. I am... I'm going to... Well, we got, we got some people who are doing all right. You know, we got some sergeants and everything. Uh, no, I'm going to leave the team as is. Everybody's working really well. Why ruin the, a good thing, you know? Uh, so we're going to now take 
intercept. We're gonna send our Sky Ranger out there. And hopefully he gets there before the guy tries to take off. Okay. What's going to happen? Oh man. Don't let them get away. Oh man. Woo! We made it! Unfortunately, this is at night time. Wait, we got another assault there. Oh man. Well, this is going to be a nighttime mission, and it's going to be kind of scary, so we're going to, uh, I'm going to give them, like, one of these electro flares in their hands. Oh, what are you doing, Jack Bauer? You have to get that out of your hands. I'm going to take that. I'm going to give you this. Everybody's getting an, an electro flare, because that's good. Bert Suggins. Okay, so I'm going to give Shant Gibbons a backup pistol. That's probably a good idea to have. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think I'm going to leave it here. Because uh, once again, I don't want to have videos too long. I'm going to have you wait here at the edge of your seat for the next episode of Rico Plays XCOM. You know, it's going to be pretty sweet this next time. And knowing my track record so far, this is going to be super easy. And I'm sure no one's going to die because I'm super awesome. All right. See you next time.